Little Kipper's Picnic by Mick Inkpen. Picnic by Mick Inkpen. Everything was ready for the picnic on top of Big Hill. Let's eat, said Kipper. Jam or cheese? But before he could take a bite... Whee! Look at it go! It was Pig playing with Arnold's kite. Watch out, Pig! But Pig was too busy to notice. He tramped right through the picnic. So did Arnold. Let's go to the pond, said Tiger. They set out the picnic again. Jam or cheese, said Kipper. But Tiger didn't reply. Instead he screamed and jumped into the pond. Ants, he said, pointing at Kipper. It wasn't just the ants that wanted the picnic. The ducks were hungry too. Shoo, said Kipper. Go away. Tiger gave his soggy sandwich to the duck. Let's try somewhere else, he said. Now there were only two sandwiches left. Jam or cheese, said Kipper. Oh, a jam, said Tiger. I love jam. Unfortunately, so did the wasps. They ran into Pig. He looked upset. The kite, he said. It's stuck in a tree. He cheered up, though, when he saw the sandwich. The last sandwich. Oh, is that going spare? He said. Oh, is that going spare? He said and stuffed it into his mouth, all in one go. Kipper was cross, but not quite as cross as Tiger. When they had calmed down, Pig led them to where Arnold's kite was stuck. They all shook the tree. Down came Arnold's kite, and down came lots and lots of big, red, shiny apples. There were more apples than they could eat. The end. What a lovely story by Mick Ingpen.